What's going on guys? It's me Greg Grovey here for this week's edition of What's New at Nice Kicks. While this video may not be as long as some of the previous videos, it is full of highly anticipated releases. So let me quit talking and let's hop right into it. Our first release is a release coming from Nike, which is not only one of the most anticipated releases this week, but of the entire year. Let's take a look at the What The KD6. The What The KD6 features some of the prominent features from some of the most popular KDs to release this year. So let's take a look at the ones on the left shoe. The Nike Foosh take features from the Maryland Blue Crab version of the KD6, while the toe underlay purple coloring borrows the colorway from the BHM KD. You'll also see the Ligra printing for the overlay, as well as the Aunt Pearl underlay towards the back of the shoe. You'll notice the K also from the BHM KD6 and the D from the DMV. You'll notice it's finished off with the meteorologist insole as well as the lining. This shoe also utilizes a multicolored speckled midsole and a blue translucent outsole. Let's take a look at the right shoe. Some of the prominent features on the right shoe includes the swoosh from the peanut butter and jelly KD, the 3M overlay from the home and away version. The underlay you'll see is borrowed from the Nola gumbo pack while this orange colorway you see on the tongue, as well as the inside of the shoe, is borrowed from the NYC edition. This shoe also utilizes a multicolored speckled midsole, as well as a translucent green outsole. You can grab the What The KD6 in very limited numbers for 150 bucks. Now that we've seen the Nike release, Let's see what JB has in store for us this weekend. This year seems to be the year of the 11 low as we see the third colorway to release from Jordan brand. Here we're seen in the black infrared 23 colorway. This model uses a black patent leather that we've seen numerous times on the Jordan 11, as well as the black mesh here, a gray and infrared Jumpman Jordan logo across the tongue, as well as the gray and black speckled leather here and the infrared 23 coloring on the 23 logo as well as on the jump in. This shoe is finished off with a really light gray midsole and a translucent outsole. You can pick these up for 150 bucks. With Father's Day quickly approaching us this month, Jordan Brand decided to release the Air Jordan 1 dubbed the Family Forever Edition. This shoe was designed by Marcus Jordan as well as his two other siblings as a Father's Day gift to Michael Jordan. This shoe features blue denim for the majority of the upper, as well as the toe cap. It uses a navy blue smooth leather for the toe, as well as the tongue, and navy blue leather around the accents of the collar. Some of the detailed features of this shoe is the blue, red, and yellow eyelids, which are Michael Jordan 3 Kids favorite colors as well as the yellow, red, and blue additional wax lacing you will see with the shoe. This shoe features a white midsole, and Michael Jordan's favorite colorway, the Carolina blue, is used for the outsole. You can pick these up this week for what may seem like a family discount for only 120 bucks. And now to finish things off, we have the Jordan Celebration Pack in the form of the Champagne and Cigar 60s. So let's take a look at the Champagne 6 first. It's not really too much I can say about this shoe that hasn't been said in our previous posts or unboxing videos. So let's just take a quick overview of it. The Champagne 6 features a gloss green leather for the entire upper of the shoe, a black and gold speckled midsole, a translucent outsole which glows in the dark, a translucent heel tab which also glows in the dark, the Jordan brand crest branding for the heel, a translucent tongue, which also glows in the dark, the famous black and red Jordan lace lock, and something that we've never seen on an Air Jordan 6 before, a championship ring lace lock. You can grab this shoe for 250 bucks. Now let's take a look at the Air Jordan 6 Cigar Edition. This shoe features a very soft and supple brown leather for the upper of the shoe, while the midsole is seen here in a burgundy and chilling red colorway. And we also see the translucent outsole as featured in the champagne colorway as well. 
we see here the burgundy and chilling red lace lock as well as another championship ring lace lock on this edition. Like his previous model, the Champagne, you will also see the Jordan brand and Crest logo here to give it a little pop. The Cigar and the Champagne edition are available in extremely limited numbers for 250 bucks a piece. So before we sign off this week, let's take a look at what's on my feet. With so much heat this week, it was kind of hard to compete. So I just decided to keep it simple with a general release Air Force One. As some of you may know, I'm a huge fan of the Air Force One, and when I saw this release this year, it reminded me of the glory days of the Air Force One back in 02, 03. So I had to pick it up. One of my favorite Air Force One releases this year to date. That concludes another edition of What's New at Night's Kick. As always, follow us on all forms of social media to stay up to date with the latest and greatest of happenings at Night's Kick. Our usernames are at Night's Kick and at Shop Night's Kick. Until next week, keep the comments flowing. I'll see you guys then.